Alright, this next question came from Mind Center School. They're looking for translations for the words jellyfish, hammerhead, shark, ocean sponge, great white, um, zebra, giraffe, baboon, dolphin, shrimp, and space shuttle. <laughs> space shuttle? <laughs> we never had space shuttle in the old days. Uh, the fish in the ocean. I never heard of uh, what they are called here in this, because we're, we're not close to the ocean. But I can I can imagine I know that there's uh, there's people that live by the where the jellyfish is, and I I imagine they have a name for them. They have their own name for them. And here we didn't we didn't hear the jellyfish because we don't have any around here, and I really don't want to give them the name of uh, I could say jellyfish in Ojibwe, but uh, I don't think that's what they're called. I I I I think the spirit already gave them a name, their its own name, so it would be wrong for me to to say jellyfish in. Uh, in my language because that's not it's not that's not their names that's not their spirit names they probably have a spirit name from the from the creator I can't give them a name because I don't know who they are just like um, <clears throat> one time I uh, I heard my mother say that uh, I didn't I didn't call him that because these these um, brothers were calling their their uh, their brother by the nickname, and my mom my mom turned around right away and says, "That's not the name I give him," because she gave the she gave her her grandson a, a spirit name, and they're they're not using it. They, instead, they call him by a nickname. And that's what I would be doing if I give a name to the the jellyfish, and all those other other big things in the in the ocean. In the ocean, the ocean is a very respectful place, and I don't think I I want to uh, give anything other than their real names, which I don't know their real names because they're they are spirits, and I I really can't give them a name, just like naming some place, but uh, <coughs> Rainy Lake, they call it Rainy Lake. In English it sounds like uh, the rain always falls there, so it would be Gimme Onizaga Egan, but that's not what it's called. Rainy Lake has its own name. We didn't adopt it from the white man's version of Rainy Lake. We have, we have, uh, we know the spirit, Anishinaabe knows the spirit name of the Rainy Lake. It, it's got its own name. White people call it Rainy Lake. It's not, you see signs all over and says Rainy Lake, but that's not what it is. That's its spirit name. So I really can't translate uh, the ocean fish because I, I never, heard of them or even ate them. Maybe I ate them in a city, I don't know, but uh, I just didn't see them. I was in Hawaii one time and we had a big fish there and it it had its uh, English name, but I don't know what it is in a, in a Tuboy word. Meatwreck.